All right. Meet DJ Cook, which is his real name, because about a year ago, well, he tweeted out this. So I'm gonna have to change my channel name and everything else, I think. That's crazy. My 100k flag is going to be worthless with the name Kodak Dogi K. I asked if I could change the name to Kodak Dogi K with no spaces, and they said no. LOL. If I change my channel name, then it will be my real name. The content won't be changed change at all, just my name. Actually, never mind, LOL. I think my channel URL has the name Kodak in it. And you, you can't change that, so I'm fucked. Well. That is until he made a YouTube video about it, too. Called, What Happened to Kodak WK? And this is what he says. So I woke up one morning and I got on my phone. And you know how people like get up in the morning and then literally like lay right back down and get on their phone on the social medias? I do that too. So I got on my social medias, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram. But once I logged on to Instagram, it said my account was deleted. For what? Like I barely posted on there. A couple of days went by and I didn't think too much of it. I thought I was going to get my account back eventually, but I got an email from the Eastman Kodak Camera Company, and they said that they had taken my Instagram down because my name was Kodak WK and that they owned the word Kodak. Also, they said in that email if I wasn't going to delete my YouTube channel and Twitter, they would sue me. I'm a 16-year-old kid, and I don't understand anything that's going on. In my opinion, I wasn't using the word Kodak against them, and I wasn't trying to leech off of their popularity with the name, so I didn't know what was up. To this day, though, I don't even have my Instagram account. I think it's permanently deleted. Basically, I'm going to either have to delete my channel, or they might let me change my YouTube name. If I do end up changing my YouTube name, I will still post the same type of videos like these. The only thing different will be my name. I might end up changing my name to DJ Cook just because that's my real name, or I might make it DJ WK. I posted about it on Twitter though, and many of you supported me. It made me feel good about my life. I really, really thought you guys hated me because the comments I would have read were, once again, not what I expected. People were hating on me. But the support of my situation now and what I posted on Twitter makes me very happy, and I'm sorry to you guys. I mean, I really wish... I could have uploaded more, and I really wish I could keep my name, but sometimes you just gotta deal with some things. I'm gonna post more, and I have a video coming up soon, and it's gonna be better than any of my other videos ever. So, if you've been waiting these two months for me to upload, you're gonna get something awesome. And even though this video is short, I hope you enjoy this one too. Just know that I love you guys, and I actually mean it. More videos coming soon. <laughs> Do I think that Kodak, the camera company, should uh, sue a YouTuber over the name while they can sue Kodak Black because of the fact that he has the name Kodak as well? And they don't even bother suing him, right? Because he's a rapper. Not, not just because he's black. He's a rapper. DJ Cook, as he is now known, has about 880k subscribers. Was it unfair that a camera company had to go after Koda WK, now DJ Cook, over a name? Yeah. It probably was, but at the end of the day, it's all for the better.